This is a quick overview of Active Textbook. It allows you to import a PDF file and then add hotspots to it to make it more interactive. You do need to uh, create a login to access the files, but that's a free process. So what we've got here is a PDF for one of our um, eLearn guides. And what I've done is added a couple of hotspots already. So you'll see up here, uh, if I mouse over this one, I can see comments that other people have posted and someone else has posted a comment. They weren't sure whether they could see it or not. Um, so I'll just say I can see it. Uh, you can also add hotspots which are media files. So we've got a little um, set of instructions for using the tool here. What I can do is uh, click on that section and actually bring down a video guide um, to that tool. Um, there's another comment pop down here. And then if I go to the next page, there's also the option to add um, short quizzes. So we've got just a uh, question about a particular feature that's noted in here. And we'll say that the field is mandatory and you get instant feedback. Now adding a hotspot is as simple as going to this section of the page selecting the kind of hotspot that you're wanting to add and then maybe um, let's say we're going to draw something over this part of the um, pdf then you can choose whether you're going to add some text uh, an image link youtube video you can actually uh, paste in embed codes for other html widgets you can have an image appear as i say video audio or a, uh, a file attachment Let's just put some text in. I'll say that's high. You'd probably put something, you know, more pertinent in. I'll just click create. And now, if we go back to normal use, we can see that as soon as the user clicks on that section of the PDF document, they get the text.